So I think I've got it set to default. I don't know what it's going to do. But uh, we're about to find out. Ooh, 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 baby. Okay, this looks like the base plate. There's the power unit, the head converter. Oh, comes with aluminum postcards. Uh, yeah, a few of them. That's cool. Some brackets, cable, elevation block. First impression, everything's packed really well. Looks like it's going to be not just a functional unit, but a really pretty unit. It's heavy as heck. I need to free up that space. <sighs> yes, let's make this thing. USB 2.0 printer cable. Material, environmental protection. It feels good, smooth, wear resistant. What's more, it's no harm for children's skin. Isn't that awesome? <laughs> All right. Oh. Okay, I'm not sure I like that. It fits on there nicely, nice and tight. Okay, I see where the cable's supposed to go in. This one here plugs into the back, as well as there's a USB cable, some form of maybe a power cable and another power cable, or maybe that's another data cable of sorts. 20 watt, 13 kilograms, made in China. Hopefully this thing lasts forever. Clean it with cotton swab and alcohol wipe. Clean weekly. Okay, that's good to know. This is, I believe, the base. Oh, with the two screw holes here. Countersunk. So let's find the vertical part for that. So I believe this will go here, boom. And this will be for the head unit. How do you screw that on though? How do you screw this on? This guy, right, 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 right. Oh, hang on, one goes here. Well, maybe there's one. Ah, uh, see, there's one that's bigger and one that's smaller. Okay. The countersink is huge, and yet the head is tiny. I find that odd. Snug him up. Ooh, look at that. Look at that! Look at that! Two of these thumb screws, and I'm assuming one is going to fit here. There we go. needed more wiggles it needed to be wiggled the focal height that's cool that's something that I was actually quite worried about how easy it would be to focus because there's I think you can buy the one that has uh, like a button that you push and it goes up and down and I was like oh man this is already like the cost of this thing is already killing me so all right these little screws there for screwing into the base over there, knobbing into here. Yeah, so that you can position things 
and just reposition them at the same time. Ah, that's what these are for too. So you could lock items in and keep them at 90s. What are all these extra screws for? It also came with a ruler or a rule. Some really fancy glasses, I'm assuming. Big one. Xbox 360 type stuff. I'm assuming this is some form of data cable. What is up and what is down? Okay, there's two little, two little notches on one side um, that I'll be able to differentiate between the two, what is up and what is down. Or is there? Don't want to bend any pins or anything like that, so I'm going very softly. Are both ends the same? Will it click or hold it in somehow? Oh, that one just went thook. This seems like a weak point, honestly. Plug this. It seems to be in my way. I did get it in. It seems all right. The flex on the cable is okay, but I don't want it popping on the inside of the unit. So I had to disconnect this cable to get this one in. This is the one that caused me issues, but now it's fine. USB printer cable. Maybe these are for updates or something like that. And back there, I think everything is filled with cables. Yup. Uh, I can plug it in. I'm assuming that's the power. Oh no, auto emergency stop maybe. And there's your power off. Okay. It's on. So I'm on the Gwaik website. Gwaik, I heard go wiki. Mm, is it Gwaik or is it G-Wiki? For now, I'm going Gwaik. Uh, cloud documentation page. On that page, there's an updated uh, user manual, which is good to know. And there's also the software for uh, Mac and Windows. I'm running a Mac, so I need the Mac software because um, it was not included on the USB key and I lost my coffee. Oh, I found my coffee. Am I downloading? I'm downloading. Okay. G laser. Okay. Mm, no. I think you hold option when you click on it or command. Okay. Control click open. There we go. Now it's asking me, do I really want to open this app? Are you sure? Yes. Scroll wheel is the zoom button apparently. Okay. Okay, so USB is connected here now to the computer. Let's see if that happens and click F1. Device is invalid. <laughs> uh, do I need a driver? I don't think so. Uh, trying to get my laser to work. All right. It's not connecting to it because the thing's not on. Dumb, dumb, dumb. Okay. I don't know what... I'm gonna put a card here. I have no idea if this is well centered or whatever, but... Two lights are for focus, so I'm cranking it down. Oh, red light preview in progress. Okay. Uh, okay, I don't know any of the settings that it should be on. I've got it set to default. I don't know what it's gonna do, but... Uh, 
We're about to find out. Woohoo, safety first. What oh, cool. Function F2. So that's 50% power, 200 millimeters per second. Yeah, that's got to be done. Stop. Heck yeah. That looks awesome.